I think Justin was trying to explain to me sort of lighting. And I kind of like that I look um, like rays of light are just exploding out of my head. <clears throat> Kitty Helper Jordan, hi. I uh, want to share uh, the first son. Is it a sonnet? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yes, foot sonnet. <laughs> And I can count to 14 uh, by my very good friend, Sir Philip Sidney. Um, and here it is. So the whole series of sonnets in this one is called... Um, hold on. Oh, it's, it's, it's this... There you go. It's this much. Is called Astrophil and Stella. This is the first stanza. Uh, yeah, first stanza, whatever. It's the first sonnet, and, and, and it's also a stanza. Can a sonnet be a stanza? Oh, Jesus Christ, my battle. <laughs> Let me just read this. <clears throat> Loving in truth, and fain in verse, my love to show that she, dear she, might take some pleasure of my pain. Pleasure cause her to read, reading might make her know, knowledge pity win, and pity grace obtain. I sought fit words to paint the blackest face of woe, studying inventions fine, her wits to entertain, oft turning others' leaves to see if thence would flow some fresh and fruitful showers upon my sunburnt brain. But words come halting forth, wanting invention stay. Invention, nature's child, fled, stepdame, studies, blows, and others' feet still seemed but strangers in my way. Thus, great with child to speak and helpless in my throes, biting my truant pen, beating myself for spite. Fool, said my muse to me. Look to thy heart and write. Did I do a good job of reading that? I don't think I did. I'm just going to give myself some notes. Like, I think that you got the ending right. I think somewhere in the middle you were just reading words and hoping you were getting the context. You don't need to watch me learn this. I love you. Bye.